Hello and welcome to another Purveyor of Light Photoshop Quick Tip. Uh, today I've got a real quick one, but uh, a real important one actually. Uh, and uh, this is about a, a, a what I call a defect in Photoshop that's been there forever now. And uh, it's always driven me crazy. And uh, that was the ability to see the paintbrush cursor on different screens, on different pictures. Uh, a lot of times the cursor would disappear uh, or at least optically disappear so that you couldn't see it. So let me show you what I'm talking about. I have this picture here of a photo shoot here we did in Fort Worth. And um, if I hover over, you can see I have the, the, the pointer, which is the move tool. And you can see it no matter where I move it within the frame. Okay. Now I'm going to show you the defect. If I take the paintbrush and I select it. Okay, you'll notice I can see. Okay, but now watch when I go to his t-shirt. I've totally lost it. Okay, and it's very difficult to see. And then I wind up shaking the, the cursor trying to find out where it is. And then when I go over certain colors or certain shades, the cursor disappears. Okay, so this has been one of my pet peeves in Photoshop forever. Uh, and I found out, uh, I'm not going to take any credit for this because I didn't even know this happened, but uh, Pixel Perfect, okay, if you're not familiar with that channel, uh, Amesh, uh, he uh, made a video and put it out here that, hey, Photoshop had finally fixed this, and I want to get the word out to everybody that uh, watches this channel too because it is such a debilitating uh, defect. So, I'm, I am pleased to show you now that Photoshop has heard us and has made corrections to the latest version of Photoshop. So I am using Photoshop version 24.1.0. Okay, so if you haven't, go to your Creative Cloud and download the latest version and make sure you have that. Okay, once you have that, now you're going to have the new feature. So remember, if I hover over his t-shirt, the cursor all but disappears, okay? So I come up here to uh, Photoshop and I go into Preferences, all right? And under Preferences, I want you to go down to Cursors, okay? And now this is the new thing that they made in for a correction. They changed the brush tip so that you can see the outline the way you want to see it. And you can have Normal, Bold, extra bold. And you can hit that and then hit OK. And look, I could see my cursor. And you notice how it changes uh, from white to black. And then, but, but because it's thicker now, now I can track my cursor no matter where I'm working, uh, no matter what shades I'm working on, I can now track the cursor uh, much better than it was. Okay, so that's that's the whole thing. It's not really a tutorial this week. It's actually just a, an announcement to, to let you know if you haven't, go download the latest version and definitely turn this feature on. You will uh, really appreciate it because having your cursor being able to, to morph from black to white to, to thick to thin um, is just invaluable, okay? So... That's it for this week. A real quick one here. Like I said, I hope you guys are doing good. I hope you're having a, a wonderful holiday season. And uh, I'll talk to you next week.